Sylvia Mary Matthews Burrell is an American politician who has been the 22nd United States Secretary of Health and Human Services since 2014. Previously she was the director of the White House Office of Management and Budget from 2013 to 2014. She was president of the Walmart Foundation beginning in January 2012, and she was previously the president of the Global Development Program of the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation. While at the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, her program focused on combating world poverty through agricultural development, financial services for the poor, and global libraries. She was Chief Operating Officer and Executive Director of the Foundation before its reorganization in 2006. She came to the Foundation in 2001, after serving as Deputy Director of the Office of Management and Budget in Washington, D.C., since 1998. She was nominated by President Barack Obama on April 11, 2014, to be the next Secretary of Health and Human Services after the resignation of Kathleen Sebelius. Matthew's nomination was confirmed by the Senate on June 5, 2014 by a vote of 78-17. Early life, Matthews was born and raised in Hinton, West Virginia. She is the daughter of Cleo Matthews, a former Hinton mayor, and Dr. William Peter Matthews, a retired optometrist. Her maternal grandparents, Vesely Key and Dennis N. Marudas, were Greek immigrants, as were her paternal grandparents. Education and early career In 1982, she was a YFU exchange student in Japan. While still in college, she served as an intern for West Virginia Congressman Nick Rahal, as governor's aide to Massachusetts Governor Michael Dukakis, and working on the Dukakis Benson and the Clinton Gore campaigns. She was an associate at McKinsey and Company from 1990 through 1992. She also served as staff director for the National Economic Council from 1993 to 1995. She was Chief of Staff to Treasury Secretary Robert Rubin from 1995 to 1997. Matthew served as Deputy Chief of Staff to President Bill Clinton from 1997 to 1998, along with future Center for American Progress founder John Podesta. In 1998, Bowles left and Podesta was elevated to Chief of Staff, and Burrell moved to the OMB to serve as Jack Lew's Deputy Director from 1998 to 2001. She is a member of the University of Washington Medicine Board, the Pacific Council on International Policy, the Aspen Strategy Group and the Nike Foundation Advisory Group. Matthews received a baccalaureate Euro unregistered trademark S degree in government, cum laude, from Harvard University in 1987 and a baccalaureate Euro unregistered trademark S degree in philosophy, politics and economics from Oxford University, where she was a Rhodes Scholar. She has been a director of MetLife and Metropolitan Life Insurance Company since January 2004. She often returns to West Virginia and to West Virginia University to speak, and a scholarship was established in her honor to support aspiring WVU political science students. Career In 2005 Matthews was chosen by the Wall Street Journal as one of the 50 women to watch, 2005 worldwide. She was mentioned as a possible candidate to replace Patty Stonisfer, who had announced plans to step down as CEO of the Gates Foundation in 2008. However, on May 12, 2008, the foundation announced that Microsoft executive Jeff Rakes would assume the CEO position. Reportedly, Matthews and the foundation's other presidents approved of Rakes' appointment. Matthews was named Obama-Biden Transition Agency Review Lead for the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation. She married attorney Stephen Burrell in February 2007. They have two children. Office of Management and Budget Director On March 3, 2013, President Obama nominated Burrell to head the White House Office of Management and Budget. A confirmation hearing was held on April 10 and on April 24 the U.S. Senate confirmed Burrell to be the head of the OMB in a 96-0 vote. In October 2013, during the United States federal government shutdown of 2013, Burrell sent the email initiating the process that closed national parks, visit also Euro unregistered trademark centers and even the A Euro OE Panda Karma Euro at the National Zoo. Agencies should now execute plans for an orderly shutdown due to the absence of appropriations, 
Beryl wrote in a memo to heads of executive departments and agencies. She ordered the action because there was no clear indication that Congress would strike an agreement on a continuing resolution before the end of the day Tuesday. We urge Congress to act quickly to pass a continuing resolution to provide a short-term bridge that ensures sufficient time to pass a budget for the remainder of the fiscal year, and to restore the operation of critical public services and programs that will be impacted by a lapse in appropriations, Burrell said in a statement. Health and Human Services Secretary, on April 11, 2014, Obama nominated Burrell to be the next Secretary of the Department of Health and Human Services, succeeding Kathleen Sebelius, who announced her resignation the day before. Her tenure as HHS Secretary will coincide with a second open enrollment period in October 2014 for healthcare insurance that began in late 2013. This expanded Medicaid and opened the health insurance marketplace. Burrell was confirmed as Department of HHS Secretary on June 5, 2014. She was sworn into office on June 9, 2014. On October 9, 2014 the Secretary faced reporters with questions about the federal government response to the Ebola virus disease and the upcoming annual enrollment period for the Patient Protection and Affordable Care Act which begins on November 15. The healthcare.gov website had completed various testing actions with regard to load end-to-end, -end, alpha, and other aspects. The secretary noted the website had reduced the application process complexity by reducing the number of screens from over 70 to just over a dozen website pages. References External links, Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, Health and Science, Walmart Foundation.